First though, Ali is off to a taste of Nepal, but it's in the inner suburbs. It's a long way from the tiny country of Nepal, wedged between India and China, high in the Himalayas, to the back streets of suburban Adelaide. But tucked away in a 100-year-old cottage in George Street Parkside is Namaste, Nepalese restaurant. Step inside and the vibrant colours combine with the inviting aromas from the kitchen to tell you you're in for something special. Namaste, welcome to our restaurant, Ali. Thanks, Angela. Now, what does namaste mean? Well, it's actually the greeting that they give in Nepal and India, but it's far more spiritual than g'day. It's actually sort of the divine in me honours the divine in you. And a great name for the place, obviously. It is indeed. We'll go and get some divine food. We will indeed. All right. Namaste is the creation of Angela and Brian Stebbing, who transformed what used to be the Solitaire Coffee Lounge five years ago into a little slice of Nepal. Thank you very much. Enjoying the food. Oh, the wine, the magic of the wine is fantastic. Well, we do a good job on that. I know, I know. Over the last few years, Angela and Brian have watched Adelaide's foodies fall in love with the subtle flavours of Nepalese food, just like they did when they set out on a backpacking trip way back in 1991. And I said, right, we'll just buy the same ticket as you. Where are we going? First, par first port of call was Thailand. Yep. The second port of call was Nepal. And I said, well, where's Nepal? I never heard of it. The rest, as they say, is history. Not only did Angela and Brian fall in love with each other on that trip, they fell in love with Nepal. They still enjoy sharing their photo albums of their many return visits with their diners. The food is designed to share and I think that sums up the, the people because when you go to the villages, they are people that will give you, that they'll give you the shirt off their back. I'm getting emotional. Yeah. <laughs> they are, they're beautiful people. Yeah, I've just never been to a place where it's, we, in Australia, people have everything and they're not happy. And the one thing that kept drawing us back to Nepal is they've got nothing, but they're happy. Head chef is Tam Bahadur Roka, or Roka for short. He's responsible for a menu that brings together typical Nepalese dishes which are distinctively different to their Indian equivalents. It's a lot different in Indian and Nepalese. Mm -hmm. And first, Nepalese is very mild and very light. Yeah. We don't use much in butter, cream, that sort of thing. Is it better for this? Uh, yes, <laughs> and we know it's spicy. Yeah. Today we're making this called piro kukura. Mm -hmm. That's the chili chicken. So kukura means chicken? Yeah, kukura yep. means chicken. First up, Rocker trims and dices the chicken. As with any dish, the trick is preparation, so it certainly helps to have all the ingredients laid out ready. I put the ginger garlic. Yep. And yeah, half a spoon and a little bit of salt. And yeah, just mix it together and just leave it for 10 minutes. About 10 minutes and that yeah. marinates in that? Yep. Once that's done, he prepares a light batter for the chicken. I'll get a little bit chilli more. A bit more chilli, yep. Yep. Yeah. A bit of salt, yeah. Corn flour. The chicken pieces are then lightly deep fried in hot vegetable oil. And Rocker's secret here is not to fully cook the chicken. Leave them in for just long enough to be slightly crispy. Heat vegetable oil and garlic in a fry pan. In goes the vegetables. Finely diced onion, capsicum, carrots and green beans. Then the chicken. A little chicken stock and in no time it's done. So this is chilli chicken but what's its Nepalese name? Uh, Piro Kukura. Garnished with spring onion and a little ginger. A classic Nepalese dish. And one of many Rocker prepares at the Namaste Nepalese restaurant. You'll find it at 41 George Street in Parkside. It's open for dinner Tuesday to Saturday and lunch Thursday and Friday by appointment. I'd recommend booking ahead. They do great takeaway food.